Hey everybody, it's just one one and welcome back to Hearthstone. In the last episode, we did stuff, and in this episode, we're gonna do more stuff. So, um, yeah, I want to do a quick video because I don't have a ton of time, but that's okay. Um, I don't really have a plan on what to do because I don't have an arena done, and uh, yeah, I don't really have a plan. So instead, we're gonna go make fun decks. Yeah, I uh, edited my Tempo Mage. I think it's pretty good. I don't know if it's 100% optimized, but it's pretty close. I should probably update the number on it. It's really cool. It's basically this whole deck where all you want to do, like, the problem is that with this deck is that if you get behind, like, you don't get the right cards, then you're absolutely screwed. You lose the game. But if you can get really good, like, literally all these all these cards combo together really, really well, you can com you can combo like Sorcerer's Apprentice and like Mana Worm. And just like spam all of your cards, and then it's just draw them all back with like one of the arcane intellects and a lot of really annoying secrets. Uh, Flame Waker is single handedly one of the best cards in the entire deck because it basically is knife juggler for spells, and you have a lot of spells in this deck, and a lot of cards are interactive with spells. So, one of the only problems with this deck is the late game is not there. I would probably put a boom in, but I don't have Dr. Boom. So I just stuck Thara's hand in and Windrunner, which I don't even know if Thara's hand is that great. I think he's pretty good, because the whole deck is combo-y, and you get a lot of cards, so it seems like Thara's hand would be fine. Uh, there's a few interesting ones, like a few just cards I couldn't really put a ton of in, because there's not a lot of room. Uh, only one Water Elemental, only one Polymorph, that's one thing I'm kind of scared about. Because Polymorph's really good with combo of like the Flame Waker, but... Yeah, also there's a low step in here, and uh, Sylvanas, I would, I don't even know if I would keep Sylvanas in, if I had Boom, I might, I probably would take out Tharasan, keep Sylvanas in Boom and put that, but anyway, we're going to go play a game with this and see how it goes, so yeah. So what's been going on with me? Um, tired. <laughs> I haven't been getting a lot of sleep recently, so I need to raise my sleep levels as much as I possibly can, that could be fantastic. So, yeah, I think we're just going to do that. We're just going to play a quick game. Uh, as long as it doesn't end, like, immediately, then, yeah. As long as we actually win the game. Uh, we can do that. So, yeah. It's a Paladin. I think I like this matchup. Yeah, he doesn't have a lot of uh, early counter-aggression. This is a fantastic hand. Um, don't think I want to duplicate. I think I'll keep that. Yeah, that's fine. Wow. That's really strong. The question is, do I coin? So basically, I can... Uh, the problem is, if I Mana Worm coin, not, I don't get anything out of that. But I still might want to coin and just get a Mad Scientist. I think that's what I'm going to do. Um... I think that's the right play. I am missing a, a Mana Worm, because Mana Worm combo of coins really good. I think I am still going to do it. I'm almost positive that's, that's the right play. Because getting that, like, Mad Scientist to die and getting like, a Mirror Entity this early is fantastic. Because if you play, like, a Shredder on 4 or something, that's just so much value I can get out of that, so. Okay, hit the trail. Double Portal. That's interesting. That's awkward. I don't really know what to do. I think I'm actually just gonna do a portal. Nothing else. I'm pretty sure that's... I'm almost positive that's the right play. I could also kill Zombie Chow with that, but I don't really get anything out of that. The only good thing about that, I think for tempo... Nah, no, 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 that's the right play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, what do I get first? Okay, I'm pretty sure that's the right play. If he plays uh, Muster, that's a direct counter, which is fantastic. I would be really happy that happened. That's fantastic. Well, rip Muster. Alright, uh... Oh, wow. Well. Huh. Okay, that's good. That's free Yeti, basically. Huh, okay. Just wasn't expecting that. 
I think I'll play it right now, actually. And we are going to do this. Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> this looks crazy. Okay. Um. What are the disadvantages to hitting him in the face? None. I don't need to trade. You can't quartermaster. I'm gonna trade. <laughs> what are the disadvantages of trading? And then yeah, I trade anyway, but really, really strong. Whatever I even want to do here. All the options are really good. I mean, this card's good nonetheless. A two mana five five. That's pretty good. Ooh. Huh. That's interesting. I think that's actually what I'm gonna do. Wouldn't it be so cool if this is a dragon? Oh my god, that'd be awesome. Alright, I think that's the play. Oh, wait, I don't have mana. Durr. Uh, why is that card glitched? Anyway, um, I think I just trade and play uh, Dragon Consort Mirror Entity. I'm pretty sure that's the right play. Pretty much for the 5-5 five, five body. And then there's the extra 4 damage. I think that's the right play because he has to play like a worse card. So, okay, I get a mini bot. That's still good. I mean, it's not as good as like whatever he's gonna play right now. Oh, huh? How's that work? Oh, I wonder how that interacts. No, physically, just thinking about it. Like, I wonder if you play Kazan Mystic, it would actually steal the. Huh. Well, that's very big misplay by him. I'm pretty sure. Uh. Let's think about this turn. He's gonna hit seven mana. Okay, this is gonna happen almost a hundred percent of the time. So we're gonna do that. That's always gonna happen. I'm pretty sure this trade here also always happens. Yeah. Okay. I think I'm just gonna sacrifice Twilight Drake and uh put Flame Waker. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna dump a Flame Waker on the board. Yep, that sounds that sounds good. And attack with the 5 5. Oh, okay, that's a that'd be a pretty big loss. So, there's not a ton he can do here, really. I just have a really good board. He can consecrate, which kills some stuff, but it doesn't really matter that much because I still have a pretty good board. It's just straight, this dragon concert has been fantastic, by the way. It's just a, it's just a really nice 5 5 on the board, even if I don't have a dragon. So, yeah, there are no dragons in this deck. So, still, that's good. There's not a ton he could do. He could Sludge Belcher, but that doesn't really do anything because the 5-5 five five directly trades. If he dumps the board, if he flames, yeah. If he puts a lot of stuff on the board, I could just flame strike. Huh. I guess he could do that too. Okay. Well, Tempo Mage is really cool. I want to play more with this deck. Ooh. I got Golden Arcane Souls. That's cool. Yeah, I'm going to play a lot more with this deck because I really like it. I like it more than Mech Mage. Like, I, like, I think Mech Mage is actually better than Tempo Mage, but Tempo Mage is much more fun, in my opinion. So we're going to go. That's cool. All right. Stick a golden one in there. Mech Mage, I think. Mech Mage. No, Mech Mage doesn't have it. Do I have another one? No, that's it. Okay. So, yeah. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I mean, I think I probably would have won one anyway. But it's good that happened anyway. So, uh, yeah. If you enjoyed this video, leave a, leave a like and subscribe. And uh, if you have, if you think you have any improvements to this deck list, or you think there's a card that is better than the one in there right now, tell me, and I'll put it in, or at least I'll see what it is. Because I think this is almost as optimized as you can get, minus Star Sand, which he might even still be good. Like if I got a Star Sand, if you in the in during that game, that'd been fine. Like Star Sand would be good. So I don't really know, except. I don't really know if there's any more ways to optimize this. Like, specifically, there's a few one ofs in here that normally there's always two of, and there's only one of in there. I also only have one draw. Uh, I don't, I have four secrets, very specifically. These are, these are very specific. So, if you guys have any suggestions or anything like that, leave a like, or <laughs> if you have any suggestions, I'll leave them in the comment section below. And, uh, yeah. I guess I will see you all next time.